Hey, Crossroads family. Crazy times we were living in, but so grateful that we still get to connect online through stuff like Facebook, Instagram, social media. Um, we, me and Christina, we are taking social dis distancing seriously um, so much. Christina makes me hurt her with these on. I'm kidding as a joke, but we really are taking it seriously. But I want to take a few minutes and just um, uh, share some thoughts with you. I think one of the hardest things to do as people is to stop, pause, rest, and relax in times like these because there's so many things to worry about and be concerned. And I think many times uh, we need God's strength more when we have to do less than when we're about to do something big or huge or whatever it might be. So I want to share just a verse with you and just some thoughts and hopefully it encourages you. We all know this verse, Philippians 4.13, that I can do all things through Christ who gives me strength. But I want to back up to the verse before, verse 12. And this is what it says. It says, I know what it is to be in need. I know what it is to have plenty. I have learned the secret of being content in every in any situation, situation, whether well-fed or hungry, whether living in plenty or in want. And this is the verse that we always quote. I can do everything through him who gives me strength. And I think that when we just read verse 13, we think, man, this is when we're about to do something big, like start a business or we're about to change the world or maybe we're about to... Uh, you know, just take a big, huge step of faith. And yes, it can be applied that way. But the verse before shows me that verse 13, I can do all things through Christ who strengthens me. It actually doesn't have anything to do with power or strength or whatever, but it actually has to do with contentment. Meaning wanting and trying to do more is actually the opposite. Paul is saying, no, 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 whenever I need to be content, whenever I actually need less, whenever I'm actually having to live in want or, or live in less, that is when I need God the most. And I know many of us, man, it's different because we don't have work. We don't have a lot of things to do. We don't go to church. All sports have been canceled and we have had to minimize everything that we do. But can I encourage you that in this time, in this moment, that maybe this is when we need to lean on God the most. Not when we're about to take a big, huge step of faith. Not when we're about to do something totally new or totally crazy or totally big. But now in this moment, when we're by ourselves or just with our families or just at home and we're not working, we're not going to church physically, or, or you know, we're not doing any of those big things. We're just r sitting there, we're just resting, we're just there. That is when we need him the most. And can I tell you that God is faithful and he is able to allow us to be content, even with lack. He's able to help us with contentment and satisfaction and joy and peace, even when there's not much going on. God is able through his power and strength for us to be able to do all things. And that means to take steps of faith. That means to start a business. That means to do the impossible. But it also means to do all things, to be content, to sit, to rest, and to trust that he can help us do those things too. Because he has the power that we need. So I hope this encourages you. Love you, Crossroads family. Stay safe. Uh, practice social distancing. But man, more than that, lean on God to give you the strength to do not more, but less in this season. Love you. Have a great day.